Hey there, Tim from Bopple here. Thanks for dropping by. Bopple allows you to accept prepaid online orders and notify your customers when their food and drink is ready to collect or on its way. Fully integrated with Counter, you can control your online menu in Counter back office and new customer orders are sent directly to your Counter POS. There's no need for any additional hardware or any extra reconciliation processes. Bopple sends daily settlements direct to you so you get paid quickly without any lengthy delays. In this video, we'll walk through the order handling experience in CounterPoz, showing how the Bopple customer app and Counter interact with each other. The first thing the customer will do is have a look in the app and see what venues are around them. They can do this in the list. They can also use the map to explore if they'd like. As we're going to use a Counter integrated venue in this demo, the menu that's displayed will be one that's been configured in the Counter online product section of back office. This is a section where the counter venue can curate a special version of their menu just for online ordering partners like Bopple. Let's go ahead and open the venue menu. As I've ordered at this venue previously, the first thing I see is a list of my recent products. The app also remembers the customizations I made last time I ordered. I can also go and view the rest of the menu if I'd like to choose something different. When the customer opens the product modals, this is where they will see any variants and option sets that you've linked to them in your counter menu setup. I'll go ahead and add this one to my order and I might add a drink as well. Once I've selected the products I want and made the customizations that I'm looking for, I can review my order by tapping the order count in the corner here, or just by tapping view order. Here I can review everything that I've selected and make sure I'm happy with it. If I am, we hit let's go. On the checkout screen, the customer can see any of their saved payment methods so they can quickly and easily reuse them. They can also add a new payment method if they need to. This time I'm just going to use one of my saved payment methods. Just below that, you can see the order types that the venue is offering, the standard being pickup. This venue is also offering table service, which allows me to enter my table number. And it is also offering delivery. On this screen, I would need to enter my delivery address and my phone number. The app will then just do some checks and confirm that my delivery address is inside the venue's delivery zone. For this demo though, let's just do a pickup order for as soon as possible. If the venue is running any promotions and I have a code, I can enter it here to get the discount on my order. And if I'd like, I can also add a note. If I'm happy with everything, then I can just send quick pay and send order. The order will create a sound alert when it arrives in counter and the orders tab here will start flashing. These alerts will repeat until the order has been accepted. As you can see, the customer has a four character code in their app. This will also be shown in counter so that you can use it to verify when the customer comes to collect. To go ahead and open the order, tap orders and then tap the order. Here you can see the customer name, that it is a bottle order. You can see the four character order code for verification if needed. You can see that it is a pickup order and any notes that the customer may have entered. Have a quick review of the order and if everything is okay, you can go ahead and tap accept. This will notify the customer that their order has been accepted and will update the status of their order to being prepared. If you need to serve any other customers while the online order is being prepared, you can put this order to the side simply by clicking send. Now you're free to make other orders for anyone wanting to make an order over the counter. Whenever the online order is ready and you'd like to go back 
simply go to orders and then go to the pending tab. Here you can reopen the order. Once it's ready, simply tap ready to notify the customer. As you can see, the customer gets another notification on their device, letting them know that the order is ready to collect. So once they come and collect the order, there's nothing else that you need to do in the pause. The customer will be able to optionally leave a review and then they can continue on with their day and using the app. That concludes our walkthrough of the Bopple order handling experience encounter. Thanks for watching. If you've got any questions, feel free to get in touch or take a look at our helpful venue partner guides. You can access the guides by tapping the help button anywhere in the venue manager console or by visiting help.bopple.me. Thanks.